Hold Me Tight is different from other um, self-help books because it has a huge amount of science behind it. It's really based on a whole new understanding, a whole new science of love. And so it's not just sort of um, some advice about how to improve your relationship. It's really about understanding love in a whole new way and understanding what responses really matter, how to really create this connection with your partner. So it's a mixture of science and stories from um, all the couples that I have seen over the years and then exercises that you can take and do yourself so that you can benefit from all this science and research that we have done over the last 20 years. Psychologists and psychiatrists started to come up and saying, you know what, maybe emotional connection between human beings is like oxygen. Maybe it's something incredibly basic that people need. Maybe isolation, this needs wired into our brain by evolution, and isolation is actually dangerous for us. Attachment theory turns this mystery of love, this um, thing that people have talked about for years as some sort of mysterious mixture of sex and sentiment, okay, into um, a kind of open book into um, something, a system that makes perfect sense. It's all about survival. It's a, a primal survival code that's built in by evolution. If you were in crisis, it will help you understand what the crisis is all about and move out of it and repair your relationship. This is true. But it's also for couples who have a good relationship now and who want to enhance that relationship, and keep it strong and make it last. It's for singles who want to understand what love is all about. So that when they do meet um, somebody and they fall in love, they have kind of a map. They know what to do. They know how to keep that magic happening. This book is for everybody. Sex is a very important part of a close relationship. And of course, it's really hard to have good sex if you don't feel safe together and you can't communicate, you can't really express yourself and you can't relax in somebody's arms. That's pretty difficult. So what couples tell us is when they can um, do these conversations in this book, their sexual life improves, it gets better. It gets to be a safe adventure where you can combine closeness and affection and play and eroticism. When people have this safe connection, all the research says they're healthier. Literally, when people fight, their wounds take longer to heal, for example, and they're more likely to have heart attacks. They're healthier. They feel better about themselves. They talk about themselves in a more defined, positive way. They feel stronger. They're more able to deal with stress. These safe bonds just help us feel um, secure and healthy and give us resilience. They have a huge impact, just not just on relationships, but on individuals themselves.